Lesotho Promise, sold for 12.4 million US dollars and yielded no fewer than 26 flawless polished diamonds. They call it the Tree of Life. With branches that grow high into the skies, roots that burrow deep into antiquity. The baobab is a rich source of water, food, clothing and medicine, adding value, growth and sustainability to all who depend on its sheltering canopy. It is in these extremes of Africa's terrain that gem diamonds inhabits. Letsek, high up in the Maluti Mountains, consists of rich volcanic kimberlites that yield some of the largest and most valuable diamonds in the world. While the Gagu mine, bordering on the Kalahari Game Reserve, is the first underground diamond mine in Botswana. Gem diamonds operate to the highest state-of-the-art technical standards, yielding diamonds that are processed and sent to Antwerp for tender. With offices in London, Antwerp and Johannesburg, GEM is a sustainable, profitable enterprise with a long-term vision for its shareholders, its employees and the environments in which it operates. In 2006, GEM Diamonds invested in the major share of the Litseng mine, an open cast operation located high up in the mountains of Lesotho. It was here soon afterwards that we recovered an astonishing diamond of 603 carats. This diamond, the famous Lesotho Promise, sold for 12.4 million US dollars and yielded no fewer than 26 flawless polished diamonds. Bye. Letseng continued to yield some of the finest diamonds in the world, including the Letseng Star, Leseli La Letseng and the Letseng Legacy. We continue to reap some of the world's most valuable diamonds at Letseng. Stones of exceptional beauty, quality, size and colour. The Gagu mine bordering the Kalahari National Park is owned by Gem Diamonds and contains a significant resource of 20 and a half million carats of diamonds. Diamonds produced at Gagu, however, are of a smaller size to those from Letseng. And it is the market for these smaller diamonds that has faced ongoing challenges. As a result, a decision was taken to place Gagu onto care and maintenance in February 2017. The mine remains under ongoing review and operations at Gagu will only restart when the market and price for these types of diamonds recovers. Gem Diamonds is committed to an integrated approach to mineral resource management in order to ensure optimal extraction and conversion and unlock maximum value at every stage of the process. After breaking down the ore at the plant, we use specially developed software to detect the trace element of diamonds. This is then extracted and further refined, after which it is sent to our diamond recovery center. From the recovery center, the rough diamonds are taken to Antwerp. Here they are cleaned, sorted by color and size and, using highly sophisticated computer technology, Letseng's top quality diamonds are analyzed and mapped. The aim is to achieve the highest rough value of each diamond, while demonstrating its ultimate potential in the marketplace. During our tenders in Antwerp, Diamonds can be viewed and examined by all potential buyers. Large diamonds are offered individually, 
while the smaller of the diamonds form parcels and are tendered on a quarterly basis. Because Gem Diamond's foremost business is mining, most of our diamonds are sold in the rough. Depends on the management of economic, social and environmental conditions. And that it is this that ensures maximum return for our shareholders, for the people and communities with whom we work, and for the environments in which we operate. Foremost, we aim to attract, develop, and retain first-class employees, invest in skills, career development, and succession planning programs, adding value to the personal growth and well-being of every person who works for Gem Diamonds, and ensuring their commitment and pride in the success we Safety is embedded in our daily consciousness, making sure that our employees are educated and continuously aware of the potential hazards they face. The environment in which our minds operate is a constant focus. We recognize that environmental impacts do occur and deal with these issues concurrently, working to mitigate while examining any potential damage caused by our operations. Our dams are operated to maximum safety levels and all operations have waste management or region surrounding the mine. At Letseng, we have initiated a wetland rehabilitation project along the southern tributary of the Karka River designed to support and enrich the lives of our neighbours, now and for the future. These projects focus on small and medium enterprise development, such as the wool and mohair projects. Education, where we support the Adopt-a-School project in Botswana. And local community-run initiatives. The Buta Bute Vegetable Project is designed to yield quality agricultural learning, local skills development and employment to generate income for the local people.